All right, so I um. No one think about it. Okay. Um, so I said I was gonna do this happy thing outside of the game. I did not. I lied. Apparently. Um, I totally forgot about it. I forgot this was something I was supposed to do. So what I think I might do is finally, I might just move on. Or if I find one at all, then I find one. Um, look, I would really like a grubbin, just because I know what grubbin evolves into. But I think grubbin's like the thing is, I like Shinx, right? But I've used Luxray. Like, I want to use mods that I don't use. Right? So I'm thinking, I'm really thinking about catching this Grubbin. Like, I want to have a team I don't use. Like, if I can find a flying type, like, obviously I've used Gengar a lot, but I love Gengar. I don't really use Ryolu, and I've used Star Raptor and Luxray in almost every playthrough I've ever done, ever, in a game that has Star Raptor or Luxray. So, if it lives a quick attack. Damn it, lived a quick attack. Okay, why is my phone... That was weird. My phone was like super fucking dull. I know the whole thing was so... For the rest of this video, there will be no cheating. But I think I'm going to allow cheating for... Uh, we're going to call you... Damn it, what was Shinx's name? We'll do... We'll do my boy Harry. Um, I think I'm going to allow it. Like, I don't think that Grubbin is a upgrade from Lux, right? Like, Vicavolt is is really good, don't get me wrong. But I can't say it's better than Luxray. Like, Luxray is insanely good. So, if I find Pokemon in a route that I've already found Pokemon in, and it's similar in status to the one that I have, um, like typing or whatever, then but it's one that I've never used. I will probably swap them, um, just based on the fact that I do want a team that I, I don't use a lot, and I already have Pokemon that I use a lot. So technically, none of these deaths are real. Like I use Shinx all the time. Oh, I was gonna name it Johnny to uh, Poison Barb. So now we have to train up Grub. And the issue is doing it this way too. I have to keep training up training up Mons, but it is what it is. Grubbin could be really useful, man. Like a Vicavolt. I don't know how to get Vicavolt to make it bug and it ups bug. It has Swarm too. That's actually super dope. Ah, oh, God, but his physical attack is trash. Bro, look at look at this. E D D E. Let's look at the rest. A and A in physical attack and E in special attack. That's awful. And then special defense and speed. I'm okay with that. A B A. Now that's dope. That's dope. Kind of bad in speed though, but. A in defense. I don't know. I feel like those are kind of not real because, like, it doesn't seem like it made a difference. She's looking for the chip. Oh, does she want some? Hold on, baby girl. I'd assume so. That's what I'm saying. Does that box up in the corner mean it's saving? Uh, no, it means you have a chest or something. Storage. I don't know, man. You asked me about a game I've never played. I don't play fucking Minecraft. I don't fucking know. Alright. So, this Grubbin's not great. If we're going based on that. Which does not bother me. Because, like I said, I've had Pokemon that had terrible e IVs like that. Where it was like, E, E, E. And they were fucking amazing. So, uh, not in this game specifically. But in video games in general. Oh, oh, do you know how badly I'd want to throw Bray Loom? I use it all the time. So I would definitely not catch it, but. Do the Bray Loom. <coughs> <coughs> Plus, I literally already have a fighting type, but. Bro, Bray Loom is dope. Getting Mega Drain, Leech Seed, Spun Spore, then getting like close combat and shit, like fucking nasty. I don't even care that this thing is paralyzed. 
Uh, let's see, that was 27. Damn it, I think it's in the high fucking... It's, at least it's either medium high or high low uh, category range. What was this? What was it? Okay. I heard you can catch happenies here. They are rare, but they're said to keep those eggs with themselves from time to time. Maybe by catching one, you could get that egg easily. If you find this too hard, you can just say no to. No, I do definitely want to find it. I'm more nervous about actually continuing the game. Because the game, rag and roll though. Probably a sturdy, but I don't think I'd kill it anyway. <coughs> I said this thing is super bulky, so. I could have used workup. But now that it has sand attack up, I don't really want to. Okay, hold on a second. Um, I'm going to work up. We're going to start it. What I like about this game so far, because I'm not using workup for the rag and roll, I'm pretty sure there's another mod, so I just want to get ready for it. Um is like I feel the need to learn certain moves that because like this thing's level 10 I'm only level 11 like I'm not that much higher than it and it can do insane damage to me like theoretically okay I'm glad I used the workups too I'm back to level 5 also from what I know Grubbin do you want another chip already? did you even eat that chip? Um, Grubbin has a shit move set. What the fuck is this pink pickle? It has arena trap. Hmm, I'm not counting this death, bro. I don't even care. Grubbin gets a revive because I forgot that. It's not fair, bro. You have an arena trapping diglet. It's really not. I'm actually going to use the Paralyze Heal just because I'm not going to kill it. But I have two of them. I don't need them. And it's just annoying me. That the one time I can attack. There we go. Damn, it fucking ate that shit. Okay. So that doesn't even count. Now that I know that Diglett does have a arena trap in this game too. Damn, that thing was level 11. Same fucking level as me. Ooh. 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 Okay, I definitely need Metal Claw. I have Mach Punch. I don't need Quick Attack. I don't need Quick Attack. Straight up, don't need it. Um, just based on the fact that I do have Mach Punch, which is... Hold on a second. Just wait one goddamn second here. Yep, 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 yep. Alright, so Grubber gets one re... If, I, if it dies to Arena Trap, man, this is so unfortunate. Like, now that... I gotta remember that. I forgot Arena Trap was even a thing. Arena Attack and uh, Arena Trap and Shadow Tag, now that I know. I'm supposed to be a Pokemon master, man, and I'm uh, I'm clearly fucking not. <laughs> uh, no, I do know Pokemon really well, but like I I keep having this mindset of like um, shit being different because I feel like some of my abilities aren't like normal abilities. I don't think this thing normally has Swarm. Like, that does. I don't know those aren't all normal, so I guess it does. Don't throw your bottle. So if I can teach you the bug type move, that would be nice. Wait, hold on. Do I have any TMs that I can teach you? What was the TM that I had? Oh, yeah, work out. That's right. <laughs> Wait, does it... Hold on. Does it boost special attack too? Hold on a second. Hold on. Just... And special attack. Oh. <laughs> Yo. We're about to utilize the fuck out of Ghastly, bro. <laughs> You've never seen a Ghastly quite like this. 
Also, I forgot I have Grubbin in the front, but we're gonna try to get some XP with it. Hmm. Literally the only reason why I'm doing so much damage is because of Silk Scarf, and the only reason why he didn't get two shotted is because of fucking Growl. That's okay. Hey, Grubbin's not too bad. It's not too bad. Once we get later and he starts battling, like, actually good mons, I'm just, I'm so scared that Grubbin's gonna die again. Three of my mons, I mean, obviously I could use the Silk Scarf on my quick attacking Starly, but, like, that's not really what I want to use it on. Bro, can I find one happening? I'm definitely doing this off screen. Okay, so Rock Smash. Forgot I didn't battle you. I accidentally released water in my house. Good job. Just to get that bear puffer fish. Look. Done flooded my house. Oh, that's it. Damn it. I wouldn't count it at work. Mm. It's not going to. It just keeps upping its speed. It's not gonna matter. I have mock punch. Does it? It dude, this thing definitely has. No, it doesn't. I think it only has tackle. I don't think it's it rock throw until. <laughs> I don't think it's it rock throw until. Is that the fish? That thing's gonna die. <laughs> it puffed up and then exploded. Um. What? What? Okay, it's gonna go into my next turn. <laughs> but I'm gonna go make a pond now that I know this. Okay, so Geodude's dead. Level uh, seven. What's the. Uh, what's the point of this thing learning mud shot? Wait, did it say mud shot or mud slap? Much slap. Yeah, what's the reason for that? That literally doesn't even help it. Like 20 base special. Special is not bad, but I have Silk Scarf, so Vice Grip's still better. This thing is Karate Chop, right? Dude, even with Silk Scarf, this doesn't do shit. I could have brought in Ghastly. And this thing can't hit me with Ghastly. This is when quick attack comes in handy. <coughs> <coughs> Ooh, that was, uh, that was bad. So, am I ever going to find a happy knee? Like, ever? God, I can't believe they would make a challenge that's so fucking dumb. So fucking stupid. Such a stupid challenge. So, a quest. So dumb. So fucking dumb. I'm definitely gonna do it off screen while I just sit here and do it for like a fucking hour, but like, damn, this thing's level six, holy shit. But other than that, like, I'm definitely not doing it on screen. There's no fucking way. Do I need two potions to heal my team? I want to stop buying super potions soon. Fuck. All right. Um, I guess we go this way. Is there a way to get. No, no. I was gonna say, is there a way to get there? But I definitely think there is. Can I find a happening down here? No, also, I can't tell if these are different routes or not. It does not tell me. So. I'm just going to have to start guessing on the routes. I'm trying to need a little bit of a drink. <coughs> See, normally, I'd say you could win this fight. If you had the electric typing. something real quick. Hold on. Stop. Cynthia. I think, I don't know what poison does do, but if I can raise my special attack. Bro, this is broken. Hypnosis and workup. Oh God, this is so broken. Bro, it's broken. <laughs> Bro.
bro, my heart sank. My heart just fucking sank into my chest. I did not know Spiro got... Oh, it does get pursued. It definitely does. We missed the fucking game. That thing gets in pursuit. Oh my god, that was horrifying. Hey, you. Sorry to shout at you like that. I remember seeing you in Armour City. You were also in for the tournament, right? Yeah, I am. I think I saw you there as well. Anyways, the name's Lucas. I'm from Sinnoh, and I came here to win. My name's Asher, and we will see. I ain't planning to go down easily. Hmm. Oh, I know. How about a battle? No stakes, just to see who's the stronger as of now. Is he serious? Oh, well, he seems very persistent. Might be simpler to accept this challenge. All right, don't hold anything back. Oh, don't worry. I won't. Why does this man have, like, a team of legendaries? Well, he clearly doesn't, so that's good. Starly. Ah, uh, what was it? Okay. It does. It does have wing attack. Hmm. I think I lose this. My team is like super bad against fine. I needed that to hit. Okay. How does his wing attack do the same amount of damage as mine does? But I'm two levels higher. What? That's not even like logical sense. And then he goes for growl for some reason. I wanted to use wing attack and live. There we go. That's what I should have done from the start. Ghastly Porygon. I have revive. I get to use the revive. That's my pull. I didn't use it on the grubbin, but whatever. So that would converge us to a psychic type. Okay, so you're not gonna really be able to hit me. Dude. If you're not gonna you're gonna have nothing oh let's go. Ryolu E B. There's no way this Eevee can hurt me, right? If this thing has bite, I'm gonna be pissed. Okay, it doesn't have bite. Come on, hypnosis. Oh, God, this thing's fucking sand attack. Okay, hypnosis. Good, good, hypnosis. Good, good. The fuck is that? Oh no. What? Did you kill a fish? These motherfuckers. <sighs> okay, so it knows it can't hit me, so it's gonna keep lowering my stats. So. We'll just end its life. Sorry, Evie. I was trying to make it fun, man, but... Chimichar. Nice mon. Nice, nice mon. Come on. I don't want to use attacking moves. It's okay. Go for smog. I'm okay with that. Keep taunting, bitch. Let's go. All right. Use the revive on the Starly. So I'm going to make that as a rule, though, because clearly this game does. Ha, nice. It was a great battle for sure. I really got to train myself up if I want to really breeze through. Well, see you later in the tournament. Um, What a weirdly outgoing guy, but he is a skilled trainer. I really got to keep myself sharp. The competition is probably going to be harsh. I <laughs> almost forgot. <clears throat> I should add the as off town. Valora must be there already, and I got to meet Ivo as well. Um, if I find a revive, I can use it on a dead mon. Since this game clearly isn't, like, super simple, and you're going to have to grind. Sorry, it took me a bit long. I got a bit busy on Route 2. Don't worry about that. Come on, let's go. What if they give me a starter? Is she... Oh, they're going to tell me about the legendary. So Jackson told you about Sierra and his past. Am I correct? Yes, he told me about how he left and eclipsing. Did you know any of this? You see, 
I'm not proud of my past. We all did things we would rather forget, am I right? You see, I have known your father for way more time than your mother did. We used to study at the same college and we were really close. Your father studied economics and I chose to learn about science, Pokemon biology to be exact. Despite the different paths we took and how different we were, we still managed to become friends. Sure. After getting our degrees, our paths parted. I became a scientist studying Pokemon. Your father, on the other hand, well, he met that power-hungry woman and together they formed Sierra. That's when me and your father reunited again. He asked me to help them with the development of eclipsing, and I was just started researching the nocturnal and diurnal behavior of Pokemon. Since I was close to your dad, I couldn't turn him down, and so I helped him develop eclipsing. However, one day Jackson called me in a panic, asking me to destroy all the research and data on the topic. Okay, the fact that this emulator game is on my phone right now, and there's cutscenes and backstories, this shit is fucking crazy. I was working as usual, and then I got a phone call from your dad. I don't think at the moment it would have been anything important, but I picked it up anyway. Hello, Jackson. How's it go? Uh, wait, you you left? And what about your wife and your son? I see. So you felt like that Asher's exposed to too much danger, and you left and divorced. I didn't like you anyway. <laughs> uh, but I feel terrible that your family broke like that. If you need any help, you know I'm here. How did Asher take the change? Oh, I see. He's only five after all. He must be missing his mom. What? Yes, of course. I'll guide Asher on his journey once he's older. Thank you for trusting me. Hope everything is going to be all right, huh? Ditch every study and research, like literally everything. All right, I, I get it. You don't want them to get to the wrong hands. So you deleted everything about the Great Eclipse and the phenomenon. Yes, <laughs> looks like you know the myth-inspired version of the story, huh? Myth-inspired. The disaster which people started calling that was not due to an eclipse. The Great Eclipse has become the truth in the public eye, as it was simple to accept. However, the truth lies in something much more different. Everything I'll tell you now is just a hypothesis, but it's very likely that this is the case. There are multiple evidences about an asteroid from the time the Great Eclipse occurred 300 long years ago. Based on calculations and math, it's estimated to be as big as the one that caused the Great Extinction millions of years ago. However, for some reason, it didn't collide with the planet. Somehow, the asteroid might have exploded in the atmosphere. How am I so sure? There are multiple small craters and rocks around Herpest, which seem to be originating from space from that period of time. How does all this connect to eclipsing? This meteor fragments contain the substance and mineral which seem to initiate the process. We still have a lot to uncover about eclipse, and the answer could be something we can't even imagine. So you deleted everything, but they still succeeded. Yes, indeed. However, there is something they couldn't do without me. They still need... Big machines and time and energy to turn the Pokemon to their Eclipse forms. I have found a way to do it on an instant with a simple necessity. Oh, wow. Eclipsing on instant? How would that work? With this item, the Eclipse Band, with this you could channel the mysterious power of these rocks, which I call Eclipse Shards. It's a permanent change, though. Once you do it, it's not revertible. I see. So this is what Sierra can get their hands on exactly. Actually, this is why I wanted to talk. I would like to ask you a favor. What is that? I would like to entrust you with the Eclipse Band. Since you're a Pokemon trainer, maybe you can figure out the secret of eclipsing. What the? Me? Are you sure? Yes. However, this doesn't mean that you can start eclipsing mindlessly. You need Eclipse Shards to do it, which are hard to find as they are very fragile and rare. They break on use instantly, and since they are from a meteorite, it's not the most common material. I can't give you any, but I'm sure you will figure it out one day. Seems... Sierra seems dangerous, as you are close to them, so with eclipsing, you can protect yourself. I hope you won't get, I won't, hope you won't need to, though, but I gotta ensure your safety, I see. Thank you, Ivo. I'll take good care of it and figure out the secret of eclipsing. All right, I hope you will have good use for it. Oh, one more thing. I didn't even have a Pokedex this whole fucking time. <laughs> your father asked me to make one for you. It's an encyclopedia for Pokemon, which most of them is an encounter in the battle. Catching makes the dex register even more data. While a Pokedex isn't too special by itself, this is a special function. The dex registers the stats and abilities of the Pokemon you catch while showing its habitat. It's something that you will help you on your journey, so you can also fill it if you would like to. There are many Pokemon living in Huppets, so why not give it a go? Thank you, Ivo. This seems very useful. I'm sure it is. Well, I gotta go now. Take care. Call me if you need any help. Alright. I got a text, my huh? It's from the Battle Center. Dear contestant, the very first round of the Eclipse Tournament is about to start. Please head back to the battle center in Amor City to participate in the round's battle. If you have any questions, be sure to ask the receptionist at the building where you signed up. Good luck. Amor Battle Center. This is the first round, huh? Alright, it's time to go. I hope Valorant makes it in time as well. 
So they said the battle shot in Azuk Town. What did they say? <laughs> I totally just wasn't paying attention to that. Uh, man, my arm hurts. I think I've broken it. Nurse, I'm pushing this Pokemon Center when I can call an ambulance for you. Facts. Alright, so this. Energy party. Mental. Oh, you can buy a leaf stone. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, I'm in deep school. You know those lizards with the things on the side? See, lizards are overrated. Are both of those things in this game at some point? Hi, my herbs can delete moves. I can make Pokemon forget their moves. Which I can do that. Nope, come again then. Looking for the Pokemon Golem on the street. No, where do I Bro, if I get a golem, I would love an extra drill. That's for sure. This is Pokemon Trainer. You must seem to have a Pokedex. May I check it? Wow, this is a well made Pokedex. It's more, way more complex than mine. However, it's pretty empty. Oh, how rude of me. I didn't even introduce my name. Is Oak. I'm a Pokemon professor from the Kanto region. I researched Pokemon and gathered data on them. These quests are different icons from the rest. They are far more complicated than the well, normal quest you can take. Completing them might take longer than an ordinary quest. These quests usually have multiple tasks for multiple rewards, and their fullest completion might arc through the entire game. They can't be cancelled, however, this doesn't affect other quests. Special quests can be in progress besides pending quests. Your first task will be to show me the Pokedex with 10 Pokemon caught. Okay, wait, hold up. I have. 1, 2, 3, 4. I think I have 8. Scene. Should I give them some fish? And I do have ten. Oh shh. Uh I don't. But okay, so that's the question. Yes. That was news. Is this high quality already? This would count as my different encounter. And they might give me a solid water type. And it's a fucking Remoraid. I mean, I'm not mad about it. I'm just... I mean, I'm a little annoyed that it could have given me like a... Are you? It could have given me so many things, but it gives me basically an artillery. But I'll take Rubber Raid. Jesus Christ. Rubber Raid, we will call you my boy. My boy. You know what? We're going to give Will a non powerful nickname for once. Let me see if I can see if anything is anything other than Remo right here. <laughs> I would have so much rather attend a eh, maybe not. Sniper? Oh, and it's attack and defense are both an S. Yeah, I would prefer your special attack to not be a D though. So that's kind of trash. Oh wait, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to switch. Memory's not bad. Like I said, I'm a little mad that his special attack's kind of garbage, but... Anything else here? No, that's pretty much it. Okay. Oh, well, actually, I might as well kill you. Do this. This thing out of his misery, get my gas lead at 12. I don't know what this. Well, I just got. It's poison all type. The books 
curse. Nope, <laughs> not on you, baby. All right, but that is cool that I got that fishing rod. I'm glad I, I checked everything. This one was okay. Can't do that. Do I need to go make you another baba? Take me a second. I can do that. All right, so I need to go back to. I was like, do I really want to trade up Remoraid though? I'm still trying to train them Grubbin, to be honest. <laughs> so like normally I could trust this thing to kill this. If this thing I mean like that actually hit pretty hard. But it, it's only level five. It has a leer and I think this thing has bite. Yep. Yupper yupper. But it's dead. It's definitely dead to my black body and Ryolu. Oh, I forgot Remonade's hard to fucking train. Huh? I forgot. That sucks. Oh, that's true. So I'm making another one. Just for the total. Okay. I swear to God, they said Azov Town now. And that's why it was. Oh, man. And I can get a leaf stone. Bro. That would have been super nice to have. Wait, am I supposed to go back here? Isn't... Wait, where's the... Okay, so that's the weekend. Alright, I have a town map, right? Was that one in my phone? So, I feel like I wanted to go. See, that's where I feel like it wanted me to go. Metro station? There's a metro station here as well. Maple Town. There's not really that many big towns here. Broke my finger doing stuff. Um, where's the metro station here? Trainer tips. Where the fuck's the metro station? It's not back there, is it? Can't be. Oh, wait. The sewer. All right, so where am I going? I'm not really. Is this where I just was? I want the take my egg to hatch on the other It's around here. Once the round starts, that's where you can enter to participate. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the first round of the Eclipse Tournaments. I hope everyone is going to have a great time, both viewers and competitors. The first battle today is Asher versus Paul. Please come to the arena and give the viewers a spectacular battle. This is Axe. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do I have time? Yes, I do. Alright, um, I say, I say we leave the Ghastly, right? Just because of the hypnosis lick, um, situation. Ryu is my, my ace, my backup, so good luck, trainer. Oh, there we go. I came here to win, and I'm gonna. All right. <sighs> so I don't think this thing can do that much to me, and I think hypnosis smog workups is gonna be amazing. I just need hypnosis to hit. Hopefully, long enough. I want at least two workups. Three would be amazing. Two would be great. Three would be perfect, and then I, I definitely win from that point. Okay, so there's two. Stay asleep, stay asleep, stay asleep. 
Yes, 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 yes. Fuck. That's what I was worried about. All right, I'm going to go I'm for this. This is going to hurt. Like did 11. Matching. It critted me, and I missed my hypnosis. It's like, I don't know. This game's so bullshit sometimes. Like, I can already tell you that. Like, I know hypnosis is literally like 45, or like 75% or something. But it definitely hits less than that. See, the good news is, I can, like, this, this thing's going to keep trying to growl me. But I'll literally switch in and switch out. Like, what? I'll switch out and switch back in. Like, come on, Boozle. You're not that smart. Pidgey. I say we, like, sack uh, the Remoraid. So I can heal. This thing doesn't get a good flying type move, though. Other than sand attack to be able to negate. It has that, too. Remoraid hit water attack. <laughs> Let's go, Remoraid. Fuck you, bitch. I don't want growl. I'll take double team, though. Lock on. That's a weird move. Bulbasaur. Go right back in the start. All right, we won. Round one, baby. Let's go. Let's go. What is Bulbasaur ain't stopping me? Let's fucking go. Fuck your leech seed, bitch. It would have been smarter to try to use sleep powder, then leech seed would have been your best bet. But it didn't work. So go fuck yourself. You didn't do it. Let's go. And the winner is Asher. Alright, looks like we're already for the winners and we already had the winners in the winners in this group time for the second fight. Asher versus Chad Rourke versus Jim. Did my team get healed at all? That's so bullshit. I can't heal. Like I obviously I can heal, but like I couldn't heal. I have to use potions for this. They don't automatically heal my team. Seems a little whack. Whatever. The ghastly idea was definitely smart, but All right, this is good for me. Like, there's no way this thing can hit me, right? It's a zero percent chance that, unless this thing has like bite right off the bat, which I don't think it does. The workup strat should work. It should work. I'm only using two this time. I tried to over push it last time. This thing could have pursuit. It could have pursuit. I am concerned about that. Alright, well, it's dead. It does have bite. It doesn't get bite until level like 13, so that's bullshit. Also, smog missed twice, so, eh, whatever. That's the reason you can't trust the ghastly, man. None of its attacks are 100% accurate. You need to stop! I still win. Ghastly, I'm not counting my... I'm not counting my death. In this bullshit ass tournament. This needs to kill. Jesus. Electric. I don't think electric even gets a good fighting move. Or a good electric move. Not too worried about it. Yeah, okay. Cool. I'm pissed off. Of course I won. Well, get out of here. <laughs> hey, Rourke's the... The gym leader. No revives. So I guess because there's no revives on this one, we just open up with Riolu and try to dominate this dude. <laughs> Baby girl! About the body, this dude. <laughs> Damn it, a sand tomb. That sucks. That actually sucks for me. Okay. Look, watch this. I got moves too, biatch. <laughs> How is this not super effective? It's a ground type. Both of my moves should be super effective. And he has a potion. Bye, I love you. That's okay. That's. That's. I'm in sand tomb, so I can't switch. 
I'm just gonna keep using Sand Tomb too. All right, we have to play this very smart. One more Mach Punch kills this thing. And then I literally have to switch. Depending on what he sends in, of course. There you go, super effective. I knew I could get this super effective move on one of these ones in Onyx. Oh, we should be good. Oh my God, it has curse. It's a little, it's a little concerning. It's very concerning if it has Rock Tomb. Okay, then God. I was going to say that because like Rock Tomb is decent stab. Onyx isn't that strong though, so... Looks like this is the end for me. Thanks for the battle. What? There's a little button you push in. I don't want to join a party, but I don't want to be angry. We have the first trainer who is continuing on in the Eclipse tournaments. Asher has won the round one. Round one. I guess what? So how did it go for you? I have won in the first round and advanced the second. Haha, <laughs> I won in my group as well. I'm continuing. That's great. I'm glad. I don't oh, but doesn't that mean that we are closer to fighting stuff. each other at for stakes? Uh, well, yeah, but I'm so happy for you. You can advance down to now. Everyone should relax for a bit. We will notify everyone in the time for the second round. Huh? What is this? Looks like the rookies also made it through the first round. My, my. Looks like round one really was that, <laughs> really was that easy considering you two made it through. So he advanced forward as well. He <laughs> not like it was anything exhausting. These trainers are a joke compared to me, and they want to win. But I suppose some peasants got through. What's with the tough boy attitude? Can't you just be normal? It looks like you still didn't teach your girl some proper manners. How pitiful. Um, I see. Okay, got it. How about we play a little game, Asher? It... I was called to head to Mount Gur to find a mineral called the Eclipse Rock. How about a race? If you find it first, you can keep it. And find your answers to eclipsing, and you seek so much. What if you find it? If I lose, well, uh, I'll have the artifact and get closer to cracking the secret of eclipsing. Does that sound bad enough? If so, then I would say good luck, but I don't need to. I'll find it first anyway. We'll see you later, pest. Erase eclipsing. What is this, all this about? It's something I don't understand completely either yet, but I have to. It's my family's business. I can't be ignorant about it. I'll help. What? No, you shouldn't flow into my family's messed up business. But you can't be going around investigating mysterious power completely alone. This Frio guy, he seems to know way more about it, this eclipse, whatever, than we do. You need every help you can get. Just stay by me so you don't get in trouble, okay? Okay, got it. I'll follow like a shadow. Come on, let's go. We can't let that prick win. Still love it every day. All right, so where the fuck do I go? Mount something. Oh, that's right. You don't you don't heal me. All right. Uh, how long is this record? 43 minutes it took me to do that. Uh, not the best, not the best. No, no, no. Use no. That is so round, route two round goes up there. Okay. Cool, cool. Uh, so we are we are going to end it here, unfortunately. Um, but I'll probably actually record a second video tonight. I'm just trying to get it out of the way, right? So episode three is done. Episode two is going to be uploaded. Episode three is going to be uploaded after episode four is recorded. If you get the drift, I'm going to record two, upload one, record two, upload one, record two, upload one. <laughs> All right, I'm out. I will catch you all in the next video. Peace out.